President Obama came through Cedar Falls today as part of his effort to expand Internet access and speed. The president stopped by Cedar Falls Utilities, which is a big reason Cedar Falls has some of the fastest broadband, broadband connectivity rather in the nation. Fox 28 News reporter Kevin Barry explains why Internet expansion isn't the only thing on people's minds. He has our continuing coverage tonight. Nearly everybody can come up with at least a handful of reasons why faster access to the Internet would make some aspects of everyday life just a little bit easier. But with big data breaches at big box stores over the holidays in 2013 and more recently at Sony Entertainment, some people say they want to expand their access to the Internet as much as they want to protect themselves from it. The Cedar Falls Public Library may have plenty of books, but Cheryl McGovern says people come here for information in whatever form it comes which in the 21st century is increasingly online. People have to have the access. It's, it's just not optional anymore. So her library has been a main part of the movement within Cedar Falls to link information in local libraries, universities, and community colleges, all made possible by one of the fastest broadband connections on the globe. Your network is as fast as some of the best networks in the world. There's Hong Kong, Tokyo, Paris, Cedar Falls, <laughs> right? All that broadband access means local businesses like Jenny Bavers, Fig and Frolic use it a lot, especially when customers use credit cards. It also means if they aren't careful, they could be open to data breaches and hackers. And our customers, they do have some hesitation and I can understand why. I guess those of us that are on the good side have to stay on our toes. So while almost everyone you speak to in Cedar Falls, regardless of party, is proud the president is coming through for a pat on the back. We know it works because of you. You guys were like the guinea pigs on this thing. They say it's on them to not only lead the way, but make sure it's safe, too. It just means that we need to, to also be very intelligent and forward thinking in how to protect uh, ourselves. No matter what happens, Cheryl says she's incredibly excited for the next few years. She says if Cedar Falls can keep trailblazing and they've gotten this far this fast, imagine what they can do with just a little bit more time. In Cedar Falls, Kevin Barry, Fox 28 News.